All right, today this is a look at the MSG Heavy Weapons Unit 15 Selector Rifle. And as you can see, it is way too big for my GBN Gundam. And it is ridiculously heavy, so he has to support it in both arms. Uh, that said, pretty cool. Let's move on to the next guy already. All right, next is Zaku 2. And he's got the uh, long rifled barrel going on very heavy doesn't hold very well i had to poster tack that in as you can see on his hand there but looks good all right here is jin rai and i swapped out his head for the sight that comes along with that which is meant to work with architects and its derivatives which this one is and in two holding or two hand holding mode with the uh funky output like electric kind of cannon thing pretty cool here's alto with another configuration as you see these guys are pretty heavy duty uh, alto is very delicately balanced with this guy up there um, this one has like a, a straight up and down kind of a opening there oh there it goes and i put the armor packs on there so looks a little heavier architect here with the rocket launchers just getting her uh, doubled up kind of a combination pretty cool uh, i haven't ever done that before so i think it looks interesting i need something up front to block that off but say lovey all right magical girl is also using the uh, rocket launcher pack at the end of this thing this thing is uh, way too heavy for her though. It is barely keeping her aloft. In fact, there she goes. Um, I think with a little help, you know, you can get her balanced and stuff. It'd be a little bit better, but um, that thing is really large, as you can tell. It's crazy. All right, here is my buddy Nero with Actually, the minimal I think you can put it together as. Um, yeah, I went and knocked it over, so he doesn't want to stand now. But uh, as you can see, he did before. There we go. Um, as you can see, it's about the minimum you can put together to make it work. But uh, that ports into this back, and he can hold it. So that's pretty neat, actually. Didn't expect it. All right, and my boy Alex can hold this very well, actually. That jams into his hand perfectly, so uh, he can hold that exceptionally well, as you can see. Uh, it looks pretty good with his size. I think that's probably the best use for it, is this Master Grade here. Didn't expect that. Um, let me go ahead and cover what... Um, and I can't cover everything because there's a lot on, on that, but for option parts, you have... Um, quite a few different little things here. So you have um, different weapon tips, uh, really cool add-ons. This one actually comes off too, so it can be even shorter. Uh, you can add this one onto other, another section. I forget which, which one it is. Another handle there, as I showed on uh, a couple of them. A lot of these armor pieces, these round ones, this is a head for one of your uh, architects or like Jinrai. So that's pretty cool. And then the missile set. And you can combine them in many different ways. Um, they come together with these here parts. Um, they are a little finicky. So you get one of these here and one of these here. And you stick them together and they combine on the inside of there. You can see there's a hole. So the small one goes into there. Actually, the large one goes into there. And the other set goes on. Uh, you see in there, there's a small hole. And then this can go anywhere where there's a 3mm port, which they graciously give you a lot of on this one. So you can hold it on the side. You can hold it on the top, the bottom, wherever you like, really. So they give you plenty of options unlike some of the other ones I've shown. 
Uh, this one's definitely worth it. It is a heavy weapons unit, so it's going to be a little bit more expensive. But it is definitely worth the price compared to some of the other sets that I've shown. I think this one is definitely a winner. Um, thank you guys for watching. I will be back with you next time.